Rastos quest for I need help which led me into I met with a pastor friend and he said there is no way they can help me until I believe I tell people when the kind of altar you connect your children yourself to is not every blessing that you I receive to I connect to the altar of this like, you know what they say lay that altar we go watch this video together may you see how this guy take expose so many Nigerian pastor how do they sleep for burial ground how they be occultic how they be this how they be that no go anywhere make you watch them so that you go receive sense. You have every right to speak into your life. You have every right to pray to yourself. Go and read your Bible and know your word. Not you, don't stop connecting to every altar that you see. You don't know what made that altar to be and the way it is. Look at it. That if you want to be a big person, you want to join the big boys, you want to run, run kata kata, you have to do something. If I make a note to talk, watch the video. Yeah? Thank you. Don't, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you. My life is a, a big journey because of desperation. I I have this great desperation for for wealth, fame, and crowd in my church. When I started my ministry, every other person I've met have always given me the same advice that genuinely I cannot make it. Something has to be involved. That desperation took me so far. There is no state that I didn't travel to. When I was here, Papa talking about cemetery, I've slept in the cemetery for several nights. Just in quest of, not just the cemetery, they have to dig a fresh corpse out for me to sleep then in the morning i will go out in the night i will come back to be sleep in that same place for several nights you promise me you will not make noise oh. please come now so that we can concentrate you have not heard anything why are you making noise please be calm don't see, don't delay my time go ahead Please go ahead. So, things was not working for me, and things were still the same as it used to be. Members were not coming, money was not coming, all my effort was fruitless. So, I have to still meet with pastors, quest for I need help, which led me into, I met with a pastor friend and he said, there is no way they can help me until I belong to their family. I said, what is your family? He said, I must be part of what he is doing. What are you doing? He said, if you can trust me, I said, tell me anything. What I can do, you cannot even do it. So tell me anything and I will do it. He said, it belongs to a black ass. I said, that one is a very little something. At the end of the day, I was initiated into black ass as a black ass member. He took me to where he belonged. I did everything required. I should get a human blood. I, I, I got it, the same thing. It wasn't working. Things were just as it was. Rather, it was, gotten, it was getting worse. So, still for the quest of power, I met with great men of God. There is no pastor in this state and outside this state that have no not come in contact with. I know what I'm saying now. I know the end of it is definitely they will come after me because there is none of their dirty job that I don't know and I have not worked for them and I have not done. The prophecies, the miracles, the planting, the stunting food, everything, most of the assignments will have been done by me. Because they said, they, if I do it, they are going to help me. At the end of the day, nothing was working again. I was introduced to a great man of God, well-known in warrior. 
at the church close to the DSC roundabout. I was introduced to him and I had a meeting with him. The meeting was done inside the car. That was my first encounter with him. And he said, can you trust me? I said, what you can't even do, I can even do it. He said, really? I said, yes. He said, well, give me first assignment to carry out. He said, if I need somebody to go with me. I said, I don't, I don't need escort for my assignment. I do my work. I do my work alone because I don't trust anybody. He said, he said okay, my first tax, there is a church that is against him and is against the church. I said, okay. I've never been here before. It was this whole assignment that now brought me to free indeed. Quiet, quiet. Before then, before the assignment, I was asked this. I said, no problem. What is the initiation all about? That people that they must help must belong to their family. What, said, is, okay. fa what is family? It's a fraternity. What is it fraternity? Is, it is, it's a society, a court. Okay. It is called the White Prophet Court. Go ahead. So I said, okay. And I was asked, what do I really need? I said, I need crowd. I need wet. I want to be known. I said, okay. But I must know that a blood must be involved. I said, no problem. Whatever it is, is a task that I can, I can show that. My initiation night, I was blindfolded to the venue of the initiation. I didn't know how I got there. I didn't really know the main place, but when I got to the place, it was not a house. It was a cemetery environment. I was initiated with human blood and I was asked to eat flesh. flesh I said okay if it will give me what I really need good and fine so they, they asked me if I've killed before I said I have not killed but I can kill he said okay no problem an assignment will be given to me because of time if I'm not making any mistake I have killed more than seven. Go ahead, go ahead. I have killed more than seven for this same particular person. For this same particular person, preaching holiness, prophets, tie head. Go ahead, sir. For this same particular person, the it was then I was really taught carefully about the prophecy's work. How I get my information. If a meeting is going on, I will be asked to enter the, the congregation to get information. And how I get my information can never be ascertained by any person. I can get your information to even your blood group and to the last food you eat, and even to the last person that even died in your family, even to your, your, your birthday, everything about you, without even talking to you, just where I'm sitting down, I get my tools. So I've been doing this for more than two years now. The miracles, everything you are seeing are stage miracles. We rent the wish years, we rent the clutches, we have people we settle for all those stage work. This was what I've been doing for him and so many other pastors. I've also worked for Mercy Land. I've also worked. Hey, okay, don't call anybody names. Please, don't call any pastor name. Please, remove any name. Go ahead. This has been my assignment. When I was initiated, I was asked for, I, they, they asked me what I really want. I said, wait. 
I said wait. I need money, I need fame. So they said the price is who I love most must go for it. I said okay. I gave them the impression that I wasn't married. That, but I have, a, I have a daughter. So they said, okay, good and fine. Who do I love most? I said, the girl I was dating. They said, okay. The very night for the assignment, they brought something like a calabash with blood. I have to wash my hand inside. Who I love most is to appear inside the, the calabash. So I went, I washed my hand as instructed. Only for the face of the lady I was expecting to appear, it was the face of my father that appeared. So I said, no, I can't use my father. That they should try other alternative. They should use this particular girl. So they said, no, okay, they will give me another chance. I should try again. So I went again, watch my hand again for the second time. Who I love most was my senior daughter, the face of my senior daughter appeared. It became a serious issue. I said, okay, I needed time to really think if I should sacrifice any of them. These are the two people I love most. So I left that day. A few days later, I got a sign that they, they are trying to carry out the assignment without my knowledge. But they were having difficulty because they need my years to execute either my dad or my my hope you don't hear her for your ear. If they catch boom 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 you run they go where you they run they go where you they run they go problem they let us see road they gain who are one blame who are no one blame I don't blame anybody but what they tell you we say be careful and know that you have the power to also pray for yourself. Let it connect to every altar where you see. Let it connect on every. Look well. They are still real people, but mechanic no let us know they will be true people. Just be careful. May God direct our step because the solution, a problem. Look at them. Yahoo pastors and ah, God forgive me. I end the video here. Please, guys, share, like, and subscribe. Bye. on my tv i do not welcome for my channel if you like what they do here subscribe like make you share them if you don't like them um, still tell us for the comments below waiting you know like now to my gist to the gist way i get for ground today you know not not sleep yesterday I did take break for from YouTube. I said, can I rest my head because I get so many things on my hand. So, and I don't talk concerning this uh, Coco Mama issue before. And um, I made, I, I talk on, 